Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Chris with Strategic. Uh, hope it's been enough time, but we kind of called the, that the terrorist attacks were going to happen here in the United States. They did in San Bernardino about two weeks ago, I think is what it was. Um, make sure you're out there training, okay? Once again, any training you can get. Mentally, already make decisions on what you're going to do. So when that time comes, the decision's already been made. You don't have to try and balance and weigh choices. You already know this is what I'm going to do. So um, I see it as only going to get worse, especially with Christmas right around the corner. That's a prime time for them to just piss off the rest of the country or the world and get their name out in the press. So um, keep training, keep training, keep practicing, keep preparing work on first aid stuff, get first aid supplies, get the individual first aid kits. Uh, after the first part of the year, we're probably gonna start offering for sale our IFACs again. Um, they're 65 bucks, we'll get descriptions posted out there when we get them. Maybe we'll do a video on what's all included with it. So, uh, we've sold we've sold a lot of those. Uh, we've got one police department that initially bought them for their entire SWAT team. And then a year later, they bought them for the whole police department. So, uh, Layton City here in Utah has our IFACs for every single patrol officer. I think the last order was like 85 of them or something like that. I dropped off to them. So, um, good little IFAC. We've had EMTs that run ambulances. We've had paramedics look at them. They've, they've given them a thumbs up. So, I'm sure there's other stuff that we can add into it. But to try and keep the cost down, that's where we're at. We, made them geared towards gunshot and trauma type injuries so um, keep keep aware of your surroundings okay try and avoid large crowds if you can that's going to be a prime target area for you for them to get you or maybe they just don't want you they just want to get as many people as possible so um, we usually the last, what, three years, four years, something like that, we've done a food drive. Uh, we've got our deuce and a half truck we'll take to local grocery stores where we'll take donations, let people bring out food and throw it in the back of the truck, then we deliver them down to the, the Catholic Community Services, which is a partner with the Utah Food Bank. This year, we're not doing that. We're not doing any fundraisers or anything. We just kind of feel like we've beaten people up enough on our fire missions that we do, so we're not going to... We're not going to try and get anybody's help out there this year. We're just going to kick back, relax, stay with family, enjoy things like that. So, um, update on the tractor. This is awesome. So, I called last week asking where the fender was. They said it wasn't in. Uh, we're going on over a month of ordering the, the replacement. I get a or I call up the manufacturer they say that they sent one out like the end of October so I call back up the dealer say TYM says that they sent you one out on this date apparently it was the wrong one well long story short they called me first part of this week said the parts in I went up yesterday no two days ago to pick up the part had them pull it out of the box it's still the wrong fender <laughs> the dealer I'm working with I'm not too happy with as far as the the service slash parts side of it. The sell, awesome. The service and sell, uh, parts, it's just been a, a giant headache. So, uh, still waiting on that. Uh, we have a horse. Yes, my wife managed to acquire a horse. He's a jumpy guy. Um, well, we've had him, I think, two weeks now. So, Got him to mellow out a little bit. Most of the time he'll come right up to us now once we get up to the field. But as long as we've got a bucket of rain, shake it around a few times, he walks on over. We've been able to saddle him, ride him a few times, but he's still pretty pretty skittish. So maybe steps here. Um, let's see, what else, what else, what else? Fire class. Fire class is almost done. Um, I think 
the week of the 19th of December is going to be our last day. Today's the 10th, so nine more days and we should be done. Um, kind of looking forward to that. So it'll be fun getting it done and then let the applying procedures begin. I'm hoping to get on with the Forest Service doing a part-time gig, so that'll be kind of fun. We'll see what happens. I'll let everybody know where I'm at with that. Uh, let's see. I think that's it. Not much, not much to update you on. Haven't been up to the property lately. Hoping in the first part of January to try and get up there for to snowshoe in. But we'll see kind of what time and weather brings. And if, if I get into there, I'll bring you guys along to kind of do a, a winter video. I don't know how much snow we've got up there. It hasn't snowed a whole lot. But you can kind of see in the background, for me, that we don't have any snow down here in the valley right now. Uh, we do have a storm that's supposed to be rolling in today. Uh, rain earlier, changing to snow, and then snow tomorrow. So maybe that'll work. Maybe we'll be able to get some skiing in, but we don't know. So... Uh, give me a call, or give me a call. Oh, they just should call me for more. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Watch our website or our Facebook page at Strategic Tactical Group LLC for upcoming classes. Um, we did a buy one, get one free for gift certificates for our classes. In fact, we'll do that today. If you call and say that you saw it on YouTube until, let's go Saturday the 12th at 5 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Buy one gift certificate for 125 bucks. Get a second one for $125 for free. That will get you into just about every class that STG teaches. So um, we'll throw that out there. Give us a call, 801-915-4118. We run your credit card, we process it, email those gift certificates to you. You can use them any, for any class that we teach during 2016. So, uh, um, if you don't hear from me sooner, happy holidays, Merry Christmas. I will try and do a couple more videos between now and then. We'll just see how time allows. See ya.